just levitate So guys, check it out. We got our first look at Rambo Raw and Growly Hamon. So these are from the GMG line and they're looking pretty nice. Now obviously I think recently is when Char was released, which is pretty awesome. So it is nice to see them keep going on with this line. Now we don't have word on pricing or release date yet from Mega House. Remember these are 118 scale figures. Um, I do want to say that even if these look pretty good and I know a lot of people are going to be excited for this line. Remember that we're getting Kira Yamato as a SH figure art sitting in the cockpit of the Freedom Gundam. And something tells me that we might actually see more Gundam pilots from SH Figure Arts and that would be perfect you know to have your master grade and the pilot in front of it that's gonna look awesome obviously I know what you're gonna say zero in order for them to be in scale the Gundam would have to be 160 scale or 150 scale or 148 or more yeah but we're not looking for that, you know, that if, if you have a 148 Gundam, then darn, you have more space than I have to put anything, honestly, and look at you, I don't know if Panda will make it that many, but still, this is pretty nice that they're continuing with this line, it's great, I like it, um, especially if you want to get characters like this, like Rambo Roll, you know, do you know that he's not gonna be part of the SH Figure Arts line? The SH Figure Arts line is gonna be making, you know, the key pilots. So, Kira, Hero, freaking Char, Amaro, all those, all those big names are gonna be the ones that are gonna be in that line. And I cannot wait, but I tell you what, <laughs> I know what you're thinking, Sir, where have you been all this time? Well, it's been a couple days and YouTube wasn't le letting me upload anything. I tried uploading a simple 3 minute video or 20 minute video and it was taking hours guys. Like 5 hours to get one simple 1080p 3 gigabyte video up and it was hell. It didn't work and it, it, it was just annoying and I missed out and I missed out. On a lot of stuff because the SH Trigger Arts Luke Skywalker was announced with pricing release date and pre-order date and I didn't notice it and when I go to Hobbit Japan and I see it up for pre-order I go oh my god there it is I'm gonna get it no pre-orders were so loud that I was like oh man <laughs> I'm so mad with myself but hey Hey, I'm still holding up hope that we get the Empire Strikes Back Luke Skywalker with his snow speeder outfit. I know it's been out for years, I know, and they have teased it for years and nothing has come of it, but when they, once they do, I'll definitely do that. You know what, I might not give up on Luke Skywalker, I might remember this is from The Ma Mandalorian. Trying to see if I can find a big bad toy store, if not, well, okay, well, I didn't lose much. Um, it's coming out in April, so I don't really have a lot going for that month. Maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe I won't. It just depends. But yeah, guys, these two look great together. Uh, you have to have them together, obviously. So hopefully you get more stuff. And like I said, if you want better figures from other series, wait. Because the SH Figure Arts line is coming. We already saw Kira painted and everything, so... We'll have to see and he comes with his cockpit i mean he comes with the seat of the gundam and i want to see that i want to see man can you imagine wayne zero's cockpit that that's gonna look so cool and the new gundams you got some crazy stuff with that line so i cannot wait to see it so yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed the video please like comment subscribe for more and i'll see you guys next time